DC7 here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Farm Sim 15. We are here, of course, on Pleasant Valley. And, uh, well, lots to do today, as there is every day here in the valley. <laughs> it just seems to be the way things are. And first thing we're going to do, I have to empty out the combine. I put all my gear away. And, uh, forgot I had a half a load of something. Oops. Oh, well, that was genius, wasn't it? Let's try again. You're just really going to do that again? There we go. <laughs> Alright, let's go see what this fellow's got. Getting quite a bit of crop on the board now. We've got a little bit of almost everything. I mean, there are some, some crops still lacking, some of which require some very specialized preparation before we can deal with them. No, oh, you're full of barley, are you? There we go. Let's get you emptied out. Because after oh, weeks and weeks and months and months, <laughs> or so it seems, our hemp is ready. Although, again, my god. What the heck? Oh, well. Um, I don't think he actually grew hemp. I think he might have actually grown, uh... Hmm. Well, I would say an indica strain, seeing as it's just tiny. Wow. Not good, dude. You're supposed to be growing that for fiber, which means those should be a... Really, really tall, like, eight-footer with massive leaves. And, uh, entirely the wrong... Got the wrong seed. But that's all right. Ours is not to question why. Ours is just to cut it down and store it in the silo, which we're going to do. And... Jeez, it's getting crowded. <laughs> Oops. Almost didn't notice a little long fork sitting there. Now, I would assume, since they're such tiny little things, that we could, uh, <laughs> you didn't see that, that we can use the uh, normal head for it. <laughs> and it is a pretty tiny field as well, so it shouldn't take us too long with this. There we go. Yeah, I was just um, um, measuring it. That was it. Yeah. Now well, let's get that little bit of disappearing. Ooh, tight fit. There we go. No issues. And we'll get Billy Bob a chopping. There we go. Excellent. <laughs> mm. Well, it's funny. That looks like wheat to me. Alrighty. So you, sir, are good to go. We're going to empty this because we will be using him to uh, pick up whatever it is we make here. And we'll have a look at our numbers while we're over at the silo. Because, as I say, we are actually managing to get a bit of crop together here now. There you are, sir. We'll get you to hemp the out, and we'll go over and have a look. So there you go. And you can see, well, the hemp one will get filled in here in just a moment. And then that'll complete that side of the board, anyway. Everything is, yeah, an actual crop. Oh, wait a minute, we've still got cotton, but I do have a field of cotton planted. And then onions we can do. Uh, soybean we can do. I think coffee we can do. But cranberry and rice, of course, require the specialties. Indeed. Now, all right, you have emptied. How much did we end up with for barley? 
uh, just shy of a hundred thousand. Not bad. I'm sure that will give us a supply to wherever that ends up going right off. And I think we'll, uh, after this, we'll start chopping our straw, I think. I haven't picked the straw up off the field yet. There's just so much of it. So, let's leave you there. Let's grab, uh, we want to plow. Want to plow. Mr. Plow. I don't have the patience for all those startup noises and stuff. Whoa, Skippy. Get a grip, dude. Articulated tractors are so jerky. Yeah, there's no view. So jerky. There we go, down the hill. Uh, for such a big rig, I think I'd want a little better view. Just so I wasn't like running over cars and things. is down below for our new tractor here in case anybody was a wondering all right get rid of all these little sticks and stumps lovely bye uh, da -da -da -da. we do however ah you sir We're down at this far little freebie sand pit thing again. And we're going to take a little trip over to Lafarge. Because I do actually have her up and running now. So we'll see how all of that is going. Not much progress here. As you can see, we still... Uh, not the one building, we've got 50% uh, of the stone, 50% of the gravel, or stone, I'm sorry, sand, and 50% of the gravel. What we need is cement, and we are just starting to produce that at Lafarge. So we'll go and have a look at that, to see who it's doing. Do -do -do -do. And there we have our water truck and a water tank. I thought right outside of this big facility would be kind of a good place for one, since we don't have any water yet down in this part of the map. Um, thank you for the explanation on the Culligan water last episode. I sort of uh, took a little tour around the bottom end of the map, and uh, the Culligan water plant that I bought... I think like episode one or something, or in between somewhere, um, came up and it was explained to me exactly what you need to do. And I wouldn't have thought of it myself. Apparently you have to uh, go up a set of stairs and you can activate a big pump and it will actually suck water in. <laughs> Here I'm looking to tip water in and uh, no, the, uh, oddly enough a facility that size is actually capable of uh, pumping its own water. <laughs> All right, let's have a look at what we've got here. As you can see, we have 3,754 units of cement. So it says we have no coal. We, in fact, have 59,000 or 60% power. Whatever was in here got immediately transferred over to the power station. So. 
We could throw a little more sand, a little more gravel, definitely need more water. That's why I've got that other truck sitting there. So, let's get this in. And I imagine they'll take a goodly portion of it and move it to the power section. There we go. <coughs> oh, that wasn't completely full. Those cranes at that one site tend to do that. Every once in a while they'll fill something 97, 98% and then just go, yeah, good enough, you know. Uh, I'm out of here. Going for lunch. Later. <laughs> Alright. So we are producing cement. Yes, indeed. Another factory up and running. Oh, which reminds me. We have to fertilize that cotton. So, what we're going to do and I got a couple of things to do here actually. Do 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 do. <laughs> yes, indeed. If they gave out medals for driving, I'd have to give them all back. Alright. Slide our little ticky ricky ticky thing back. There we go. And let's drag you over. You are full. Yes, you are. That's what I thought. I hope they don't mind us driving through their facility like this. But I don't think it's open yet, so we're good. Mm -hmm. Cutting across your fields. Well, I guess these are stock pens, eh? Hmm. Wow. <laughs> yeah. So a little bit of water. And then I'm actually going to go back and grab that coal truck. Because my next project... Uh, still harvesting hemp. He's only at 57%. Good. My next project is actually... Uh, involves some coal. I want to keep the uh, wood plant running. And I need to deliver the eight, eight pallets of boards that we have so far right you're still plowing away good boy <coughs> excuse me uh, uh. Do -do -do -do. I was hoping you'd just keep going <laughs> Could have been almost there by now. <coughs> so we'll take you down, let you fill up with coal. And I do need a truck. I do, I do, at the farm. Because we need to fertilize our cotton field. Yes, indeed, them old cotton fields back home. Alrighty, in you go. Lunch hour. <laughs> I don't want to know it's lunch hour. Oh. Grr. Lunch hour. See, now I get to walk around with this in my face. Hmm. Although, apparently, if you don't have anything parked in these tip spots, you don't have to. But, really? So I can... Oh, look. <laughs> do it again. Come on, do it again. Come on. Come on. Aw, oh, man. I had a glass trailer there for a moment. I'm going to uh, zippity-doo time a bit here. I can't... Uh, I'm not going to sit here with this in my face for the length of time they seem to think I should. 
There we go. I need this truck. Giddy up, go. Very important. And then we need to head out to our logging site. And as soon as I get this fella on the job of fertilizing the cotton field, then yes, indeed. Okay, yeah. Now that you're out here, let's just get you where we need you to be, shall we? No idea why I have such sharp curbs on this road. Well, all the roads, actually. It just about flips this truck over sometimes. <laughs> I rolled one of the tractors yesterday, working out at the forest area. <laughs> I come whipping up there with the doits, and I had a uh, log fork on the front. And... Yep, I hit a stump. <laughs> and I guess I hit it at exactly the right angle, I swear. It was just like a real accident, the way the thing rolled over. It kind of nosed down and then flipped over. I wasn't expecting it to flip. It's so seldom you actually do that in this game. You know, but yeah, rolled right over, landed back on its wheels, and continued on, of course. <laughs> Another beautiful thing about physics in this game, of course. They don't actually work. <laughs> and it's amazing how helpful that can be at times. So, I think we... Uh, cut over a little bit here, we're a bit far off. Alrighty. Hey mate. <laughs> there we go. Working hours. Oh no, now I got that to put up with? Oh, I guess I kind of uh, went right through that, didn't I? Oh, God's sake. See, I hate this. This is crap. So you get it for two hours during the middle of the day, and then another 14 hours. So for 16 hours a day, you get these damn signs. Oh, what a pain. Alright, hopefully I've got some fertilizer ready. Yes, we do. Of course, now I've also got the joy of not being able to see a damn thing. There we go. Alright. Oh, this is... Yeah, I can't... See, I can't even do the job I wanted to do now. I wanted to go to the forestry and grind all those stumps away. Well, you can't see where the stumps are. So unless I go and move every single vehicle away from tip points or collection points, that will stay there. Unreal. Not impressed. <clears throat> Let me tell you. What? Oh, did I really advance time so far that this is already harvestable? Oh, good lord. Well, you know what? I know in real life this is crap. But if they'll let me, I'm gonna do it anyway. Yes, they will. Good. Let's get a layer down. And we have no choice. It's gonna get really dark here in a minute, guys. So, um... In fact... Yeah, I'm going to make this a fairly short episode, I think. Next time around, we will deal with the uh, the forestry stuff. For the moment, I will... Uh, oh, I see the hemp trailer's full. So we'll go visit that. Yeah, this whole area, as we can see, oops, is completely deforests and... Uh, I need to plant some saplings, but I need to grind these stumps first. And you can see there is a few of them. But I'm thinking that uh, right where I'm going to want to focus the old stump grinder is pretty much right where I'm not going to be able to see anything. So, yeah, this is pretty much pointless, isn't it? Alright. 
So, switch over to our front stumpy dumpy. Lower it down. There we go, turn it on. I think this thing would chew them up a little quicker. So yeah, this is uh, sort of my next project here. Once I get all the stumps out, then we can plant some seedlings, saplings, sorry. And uh, we will in fact do that. But there are a few stumps. <laughs> a few indeed. So, but as I say, guys, I think I'm going to leave the episode there because I don't want to drive around with this thing in my face the whole time. So, uh, I'm going to have to advance time. And the problem is, one, the map really slows down during the night cycle. I guess the different shading and stuff, shadows that are being used, puts a little more of a demand on the map. And, uh, well, she doesn't speak. Oh, here's the stump I tripped over to see how tall that one is. Yeah, I didn't even see it. Caught one front wheel. And that was it. Just ba doing 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 Endo. <laughs> and then barrel roll back onto the wheels. So, yeah. What the heck is this? 150. It holds wood chips? Why? Really? <laughs> Great. Maybe I can take them up and throw them into the uh, leftovers bin there. Up at the... Sawmill. Yeah. Oh. Apparently we lost some that time. We're down to 110%. <laughs> I don't know. Anyways, guys, that's going to do it. Hope you enjoyed the episode. We uh, got a fair bit of work left to do here. Till next time, we're going to produce cement. We're going to cut the rest of the hemp down. Maybe clear some more of these stumps. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Take care of each other, folks. If you enjoyed the episode, please hit the like button. Do all the favorites and shares and youtube -y things that we all love to do. And above all, well, take care of each other, folks. And ciao for now. All right.